Need to better manage your company's bookkeeping? We've created a bookkeeping spreadsheet template in Excel and Google Sheets that you can use to assist your bookkeeping. Whether you're a small business that needs to manage its finances, a bookkeeping and payroll service provider, or an accountant working inside a large corporation, this bookkeeping spreadsheet provides detailed charts and graphs to easily track your income, expenses, and profit across any time period. We'll now show you how to use the bookkeeping spreadsheet template we created to easily manage and visualize your bookkeeping data. The bookkeeping template begins with the Fields tab. Enter your general report and company title, which will appear on every page of the bookkeeping spreadsheet. Below that, the drop-down fields that will be referenced in the rest of the spreadsheet are defined. Enter the income source, category, and expense category fields that your businesses use. Next to expense category, you can also define the names of the accountants or bookkeepers that will enter the data. On the vendors tab, define the vendor name, vendor category, vendor product, contact name, and contact information of all the vendors you do business with. This is important because based on research from the Hackett Group, the average company has 3,000 suppliers per every $1 billion in spend, and major companies can easily have hundreds of thousands of suppliers. These aren't just physical goods though. Another report found that the average company uses between 40 to 60 SaaS applications, while enterprise businesses could have up to 364 applications. Even companies with fewer than 50 employees use an average of 16 SaaS apps. So no matter your size, it's important to have a database to manage all of your vendor information in one place. Now, once your income, expenses, and vendor categories are defined, use the income and expenses sheet to track your income and then expenses. Begin with the income tab. Enter the date of the transaction and the description of the income. Then, select the income category from the drop-down field. Then, choose the vendor and income source, as well as the amount of any tax that was collected with that entry. The net total is then tallied. Because income and expense taxes can vary by region and individual items, the tax column is an editable user input. But if your tax rate is fairly consistent, like if you do business all in the same region, then a simple calculation can be added to these columns for ease of use. If multiple team members will be entering data, select who entered the transaction in case questions arise later on down the road. If a transaction requires further explanation, then the notes column can be used to enter any details that need to be referenced later on or referenced by other team members. The expense tab works the same way. Enter the date, description, category, vendor, the amount, tax due, and who entered the entry. This spreadsheet is built to accommodate multiple years of data. And remember, if you want to utilize this bookkeeping spreadsheet to manage your expenses and income, you can download and customize it right now. Now that you've loaded all of your transaction data into your income and expenses tabs, go to your dashboard tab and you can filter any date range for analysis. The filters also allow to select a single income category, an expense category, for more granular analysis. The reason this might be impactful is because the dashboard tracks transaction data by month for an indefinite period of months. Since all the charts below are impacted by these filters, you could track how a single income or expense category changes from month to month over a period of multiple years for in-depth analysis. The charts are first organized with a total summary of all income versus expenses, as well as total profit over a given filter period. As the filter range changes, this data also changes, so make sure your selected date range is accurate to the period you want to assess. Below that, the total income by month and total expenses by month are visualized in a line chart time series. Then, the cumulative income by month is tallied, followed by the cumulative expenses by month across two bar charts. Following that, the income versus expenses per month are compared side by side in a bar chart and overlaid one another in an area chart. The goal here is to provide multiple views for how your data is displayed to provide reports. Last, another time series tracks the profit by month, as well as the profit, income, 
and expenses by month, so important trends over time can be surfaced for deeper analysis. Last, the category overview section details all the income categories as both a bar chart and a pie chart. Underneath that, all the expense categories are visualized as a bar chart and a pie chart as well. At the bottom, an analysis table details the data for all the months and categories in the search filters so you can see the numbers for all the months at a glance. These reports are important to track the financial health of your business over time, to set and maintain annual and quarterly budgets, and to plan for headcount increases and other growth milestones. With easy-to-read charts that visualize your financial information at a glance, this dashboard is perfect to share with external stakeholders or to power up your analysts with the tools they need to make the best decisions for your company's future. To supercharge your bookkeeping, you can download and customize this bookkeeping spreadsheet template in Microsoft Excel or Google Sheets right now. After that, go check out our quarterly report presentation template to supercharge the design and layout of your quarterly reports as well. Thanks for watching.